What's going on, everybody? This is Super Live, and we are back with another live stream here on my channel tonight. We're going to be doing my first live stream of Banjo Kazooie. Now, uh, this will not be the version that was released on the Nintendo 64. Uh, unfortunately, I have no way to actually live stream uh, any Banjo Kazooie game from the Nintendo 64. I'm actually using the Xbox One. Uh, that is what we're going to be live streaming from. It's basically the same game with some changes to where, you know, none of the t Nintendo logo or N64 logos are utilized. But anyway, guys, let's go ahead and do our shout outs. we got a few of you joining us here at the very beginning of this live stream. we got YSL Elliott, Mason, Sunshine Nickerson, Agent 3. Um, let's see here. we got Gameblade, Demetrius Turner, Jennifer Vlogs, Mr. Watermole, Henry, and DK Racing Fan. Welcome to the live stream, guys. Also joining us today are my moderators. We've got Ethan Kua, Zach Carmen. Uh I think that's everybody. I think that's all. Oh, and Brand Eyes Gaming is also here. Welcome, Brand Eyes Gaming. Good to see you. Hey, Tornado Media just popped in the chat there. Welcome. Welcome to the live stream. What's going on? Also, one of my uh sponsors, Sadie Gamer Mom, is joining us here. Welcome, Sadie. Good to see you. How are you today? All right, so with that, we're going to go ahead and get started with the game. Uh, oops, not that. The game. There we go. That's what we wanted to do. But anyway, here we go, guys. Now, <clears throat> I started off the live stream on the stream starting soon screen. The video that you guys saw uh, is actually from the N64 uh, intro. So we're going to show the Microsoft version or the uh, you know, the, the Xbox version of the intro right here. And you'll see the uh, the changes that they made. You know, none of the Nintendo logos, like the N64 logo or the Nintendo logos actually utilizing this. So, yeah, basically the same scene. Everything changes. Hey, Gaming Predator and Mr. Smile More DJ, welcome to the stream. Good to see you guys. Thanks for joining us. Oh, nice. Your island, your second island is now five stars. That's great, Sadie. Awesome. And there you go. See, it says Microsoft Game Studios instead of Nintendo there. <laughs> so no, no, no need for subtlety, right? Rebel ILS, welcome to the live stream. What's going on, buddy? Thanks for joining us. Oh, nice. you gotten pretty far in the uh, Paper Mario game. That's good, Zach. Good to hear, man. Uh, 
And the best part of playing it on the Xbox One, guys, is the fact that everything will be in HD. So, so it looks really, really good. Now, I've actually tried playing this, uh, you know, during, uh, well, prior to this live stream. I played it a couple of nights ago, you know, testing out the equipment, making sure that everything looked good, everything sounded good. Um, but yeah, it looks like everything is, uh, you know, looking pretty good there. So I guess we're going to be okay. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started uh, with the game. Now, this doesn't actually have real vocal dialogue. It does have somewhat of a dialogue, but, you know, rather than let... Rather than actually speak the lines, I think I'm going to have the game do the talking. Such a great intro, by the way. Love this intro. <laughs> what? You're surprised? You're surprised that there's somebody prettier than you? That's true, Zach. She does. Alright, so here we go. This is where we get our intro to the uh, protagonist of the game. Banjo and Kazooie. Princess Isabel, hello. Welcome to the live stream. It's good to see you. Glad that you have returned. Thank you for joining us tonight. I agree, Brand Eyes. This this de this game definitely has a lot of charming aspects to it, and my hats off to the Rare team that developed this game. They did a lot of great writing with this. <laughs> wow, what a silly question. Is that your brother there? <laughs> Yeah, up there in the sky, really? <laughs> oh, I don't think so. I mean, why is there even any doubt, you know? Now, what I noticed about this version of the game is they take away the uh, the, the, the fighting sound effects in the background. There's usually a lot of banging and scrap... Well, anyway, if you played the N64 version, you would know what I'm talking about. All right, so now we go right into the gameplay of the game. And just so you guys know, um, Goggles, or Bottles, or whatever the heck his name is. I think it's Bottles. Yeah, and we'll uh, we'll go through all this. Yep, Buddy Kazooie sure is a strange-looking Buddy Banjo. Can it talk? Better than you can, Goggle Boy. That's right. <laughs> What's all that noise about? Where's my sister, Tootie? Dangly witch Gruntilda swooped down out of the sky and grabbed her. <laughs> Calm down, Geeky. We'll be, we'll get her back. Where'd she go? She flew up to her mountain lair. It's really dangerous, so you'll probably need some training before you go up there. It's one of the things I didn't like was the fact that the dialogue lines are only two. There, there's only two of them. 
Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and hit B because I've already I already know the uh, the move sets. All right, so there we go. All right. All right, so what we're gonna do now is uh, we're just gonna go through all the different move sets. You have this one right here, and you have this one here, and you have this one, and then you have, yep. So anyway, yeah, there's a couple of move sets that you learn um, in this in this section, known as Spiral Mountain. Um, we're not gonna go through all that. Basically what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna go through and try to find all the honeycomb pieces so that I can increase my health. Once we've done that, we'll move on to uh, Gruntilda's lair. Now, the camera set here isn't exactly the best, but you can usually back the camera back all the way so that you can have a better angle as far as what, uh, you know, is going on on the screen. So I usually like to have my camera all the way back, all the way back so I can see everything. Nathan Byberg, welcome to the stream, buddy. Good to see you, man. How's it going? Yep, Super Live Gaming on Xbox. I know, right? I told you guys I was going to do this, man. Oh, it's your favorite game ever there, Nathan? Nice, man. Well, I'm glad you're here with us tonight. And don't worry, guys. We won't go for too long. You know, we'll, we'll get as much done uh, in the next two hours uh, to beat this, uh, like, you know, to basically work till completion. Um, but yeah. yeah. I hope you guys enjoy the show tonight. Doing very good. Yeah, that's awesome. Oops. So I need to find two more honeycomb pieces. Yeah, under the water. Yeah, it's under the uh, spire or the the uh, spiral mountain thing, whatever they call it. I'm just gonna say the pathway to uh, to Gruntilda's lair. There we go. Oh no, this isn't blind. I've played this before, but it was many, many years ago, man. I was still in high school when I first played this. You know everything there is about this game? Well, nice, man. That, that you'll uh I'll, I'll I'll definitely be seeking your help if I get stuck somewhere, you know what I mean? There we go. All right. So we got an extra life. So that's good. Well, that's good. That's good. Yeah, like I said, you know, uh, if I ever need any help, I'll uh, be more than uh, happy to get you uh, guys to oh, get get you guys to tell me where where we need to go. Ah, screw it. You know what? I was gonna use a shortcut, but uh, I'm just gonna go. It's gonna backflip up to the uh, next. Uh, the next level there, but I'm just going to go around the long way. Ah, perfect. By the way, guys, thank you so much for 19 likes on this live stream so far. That is great. 
We're one like away from a 20 like hype. We've got 12 of you watching the show right now. If you guys know anybody else who would like to join us on tonight's live stream, be sure to share it on various social media platforms such as Twitter and Tumblr, as well as Facebook, Reddit, and Discord. Oh, speaking of which, I've got to... Uh, yeah, give me a second, guys. I've got to save this on... Uh, or not save this, but uh, I, I forgot to post it on Discord. Holy cow. So my bad, guys. We'll get going here in just a second. I just want to make sure that uh, we share it on Discord first. Yeah, how's the audio and video quality, by the way, guys? Everything sound good? Everything look good? Yeah, let me know. Alright, I believe we're going to go into another cutscene here shortly. Yep, here we go. Got a jiggy. Awesome. All right, here we go. So now we're going to move on to the next world. Or the first world. Technically, it's the first world. You found all the jiggies? Good, man. Oh, whoops. I hit the wrong button. My bad. There we go. Did you find all the music notes? Yeah, that was such an easy fit. Of course it was. We get some new moves here on this, uh, in this new world here. Those guys are really easy to take out. There we go. Alright, so we got him. We'll worry about those notes later. Actually, what I want to do is I want to go underwater here. Or better yet, let's just go ahead and collect these first. Whee! Now, the camera controls here are not exactly the best in the world. Because at the time, you know, it was, uh, you know, during the Nintendo 64 days. So I'm sure you guys can imagine that it was probably, <laughs> it's probably uh, kind of uh, weird or new. Well, I'm going to say new. It was new to them trying to figure out what, what to do with the camera here in this game. All right, we're not going to worry about that. Right, I guess I got to deal with this guy. Let's go ahead and take care of this first. There 
There we go. Alright, so we got that. Not very hard. Not very hard. The first the first world's actually pretty easy. Hey, Kevin M, what is going on, man? Welcome to live stream. Good to see you, dude. Alright, so we got nine more we need to find here in this world. Oh, that's right, I gotta talk to him first. Yeah, he wants an orange. Easy enough. There we go, we'll just hand it over to this guy. You missed the N64 days there, Ethan? The honeycomb box has bees swarming around it. Yeah, that's true. And in Banjo-Tooie, if you guys have played Banjo-Tooie, they, they, they do something else. They do something else which is unique to that game. So I don't know if you guys are familiar with uh, Banjo-Tooie. Oh, which, by the way, I do plan on live streaming. I do plan on live streaming that game. Banjo-Tooie. But we gotta finish this game first. Alright, time for the buzzer to learn the ancient ways of shooting eggs. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Sounds painful. I wish I never asked. Nice. You need to redo this game on your channel. Why do you need to redo it there, Kever? Alright, there we go. So he hooked us up with uh, more eggs. Oh, that reminds me. we got to collect uh, five of those. Oh, that's right. I've got to uh, I gotta learn that attack. The uh, B drill. Whoops. My bad. I just got to remember... Oh, no! I keep falling off. Sorry, guys. <laughs> there we go. Whoops. Dang it! No! There we go, we got him. Because you didn't have to lay it out of the time, I feel like I could do one a better job of the game. Ah, oh, it's okay. Yeah, don't sweat it there, Kevin. Nice. There we go. Took a lot of damage over there, unfortunately. But we've got this here, so that's good. Alright, so the next place we're going to go is we're just going to move up this hill here. Alright, we're going to ignore these guys. We're going to move to the left. We're going to talk to Bottles over here. Yeah, this is where we learn the Talon Trot. Very important. Super Mario Brothers 3 days are crazy. Super Mario Brothers 3 days are crazy? What? What are you talking about there, Mason? 3 days? What's going on in 3 days? Sorry, buddy. You need to, have, you need to add a little more context to that comment there. Super Mario Brothers or Super Mario Brothers 3? Ah. So one of those two. Yep, can't leave any note left behind. There we go. Got 
Got a Jinjo. Nice. Now, Talon Trot makes it easy for me to navigate this. If I didn't have the Talon Trot, we wouldn't be able to actually go to each of these platforms using the hill. We collected all enough notes to break the first note door. Great. And yeah, my plan is to 100% this game, guys. So, yeah. If I need help, I will let you guys know. Ah, oh, so good. So good to be back playing this game. I, I, I gotta tell you guys, I've been very, very, um, you know, very, very excited about playing this game and featuring here on the channel. I'm glad we're able to do it now. I'm just gonna go straight over here and, and, and collect all of these guys. There we go, got another one. Awesome, thanks Nathan, appreciate that buddy. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. Try again. Oh, there's a mumbo token there, good. All right, so I need to collect I need to collect one more. The next one will be in Ticker's Cavern, or Ticker's Mound, which is where those ants are. Alright, hopefully I haven't missed any notes. Now, I don't know why, but I believe they got rid of the ability to actually look at, uh, what's it called? Um, oops, that was a mistake. Right, we're not going that way. Oh, yikes. By the way, there's no way we can kill that guy. You can, you can, you can actually, uh, um, stun them for a little bit, uh, if you use the, uh, if you use the invisibility, or invincibility, uh, uh, with the golden fe feathers, but, uh, yeah, that, that will only temporarily stun them. They'll come back, yeah, they'll come back and they'll attack you again if you're not careful. That's right, I gotta talk to this guy first. Alright, hook me up, man. I call this the Beak Buster. So, Orange9075 is joining us today. Welcome, or Orange975. We also have Nick Sweet. Hello, Nick Sweet. Good to see you. Thanks for joining us, guys. And thank you for 24 likes on the live stream, guys. Thanks for the support. You guys are awesome. Can we make it to 30 likes tonight? Let's hope so. This is how we're going to unlock the uh, remaining notes. Oh, those are just eggs. That's okay. Nice. There we go. Alright, so this should be number eight. No, that's number six. There we go. Alright, so we need to collect ten or yeah, ten more music notes and then we'll be done. Just need to go up here and collect this jiggy. No, no, I am 100%ing this game. Yeah, I'm gonna 100% this game, Kevin. Yeah, the game is to be 100%ed. That is definitely gonna happen. That is the plan. Alright, so all we gotta do is just talk to Mumbo. Mumbo's gonna hook us up. At least I think he's gonna hook us up. Or I hope he's gonna hook us up. Me Mumbo, best shaman in the all game, can help Banjo and Filthy Feathered Friend. 
Bombo's magic tokens hid by which? Find tokens. Ah, Banjo has plenty of tokens. Stand on skull and press X to see mighty Mumbo magic. Great. Alright, just so you guys know, if you jump onto this pedestal here, you can actually climb on top and, you know, collect all this stuff here, too. You'll find out in future worlds that they'll hide uh, music notes up here, too, so just FYI. Alright, here we go. Fire Emblem TJ! What is up, dude? Pokemon Go Charizard, hello to you as well. Thank you for joining us. All right, there we go. Now we are an ant. We should be able to ascend Ticker's Tower now. Hey, where did you get those shorts? <laughs> That's funny. Give me that cool backpack or else. Nice. Whoops. Missed the jump. Ah. Gotta climb again. By the way, guys, if you touch the uh, the other ants in this game, uh, it, you, you will, I mean, as an ant, you still get harmed by them. So, just FYI. Oh, man. I don't know why I always have trouble with that one, you know? Oh, shoot. Whoops. There we go. We found all the music notes. Awesome. There we go. Alright, this should lead to the exit. And the final jiggy on in this world. Oh, that's only number nine. Okay, so we got number nine. So, oh, that's right. I've got to get the. Uh, I got to get that one. You just had trouble with Jolly Roger. Oh man. Dude, in Banjo, in Banjo Tui, man, they 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 made some pretty uh, pretty big water levels, underwater levels in Banjo Tui or or underwater worlds, and uh, I gotta say, man, it creeped me out, you know, because of how deep it was. Oh, whoops! I why do I always hit the wrong button when I do? Oh my gosh. See, the lineup on this has to be very precise. For whatever reason, it has to be very precise. There we go. That's right, I almost forgot. There we go. I gotta be able to get that. There we go. Nice. Alright, let's go ahead and head out. We're done. We're done with this world. Yeah, and we're only 30 minutes into this game and we've already finished the first world. How about that, huh? Oh. Wait a second. I forgot, guys. I got one more that I need to uh, to get here. Oops. I forgot to use the uh, the uh, drill beak over here on this switch. So we gotta hit the switch, and I gotta get an orange again for that monkey over here. 
There we go. Pick him up. Take it. You think there was a temple? Uh, yeah, in Banjo-Tooie, there's a temple. There is a temple in Banjo-Tooie. That's the first world in that game. I forgot what the name of that temple was, but we will be visiting that temple here in the near future. There we go, there we go. And I have to go to, um, what's it called? Um, Mumbo again, and I have to... Have to turn into an ant, otherwise I'm never gonna be able to get that uh, that jiggy. Yeah, Banjo Two is literally Banjo Kazooie Two. I agree. I agree. Ah, oh, there we go. Gruntilda switch. Hook me up. Mr. Smilemort uh, says, Don't forget when you return to Mumbo's house, you will get a jiggy when you shoot an egg in their mouth. Oh, you're talking about the uh, that totem pole thing that we just took out? Yeah. Already done. Already done. We're good there. Oops. I'm telling you guys, this camera sometimes uh, leaves a lot left to be desired. But again, you know, just one of those things that they, uh, you know, couldn't... Uh, uh, couldn't... Well, I mean, they tried to perfect it as best they could, I suppose. Oh, wait, that's right. I can... I can actually leave the area, and, uh, the magic will go away. Mumbo, magic get weak. Animal turn back, or magic go. There we go. There we go. I'm good with it. I'm good with it. We need to... We need to move on. We gotta further this plot, right? <laughs> Whoops, that was a that was a mistake. See actually you can't go up this passageway here unless you have the talent trot. So there we go. Awesome. By the way guys, we're getting some lag spikes. Uh just uh stand by. Uh, hit the refresh button or something and it'll come back. I forgot the honeycomb above water inside of the mountain. No, I, I already got that one, DJ. Yeah, I got it already. Yeah, I actually uh, floated uh, over to it. Hey, Nick Sweet with the $2 donation via the Super Chat. Dude, thank you so much for that $2 donation, man. Guys, let's get the hat, uh, hashtags, hearts, and emojis for Nick Sweet for that $2 donation. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate that. All right, let's go ahead and open the door so we can further this plot. All right, here we go. All right, so check this out, guys. Gruntilda actually has a sister. This is her right here. Hello there, young ones. I'm Gruntilda, Gruntilda's nicer sister. I've crept down here to help you defeat the old hag. It's about time she was taught a lesson. I know all of Grunty's disgusting secrets. And I'll tell you three of them every time you find me. Remember them well, young ones, as they will help you avoid a fiery fate. Press X if you'd like to hear them. Well, sure, let's hear it. Grunty brushes her rotten teeth with salted slug-flavored toothpaste. Salted slug-flavored toothpaste, you don't say. She also washes her hair with engine oil. Yuck, engine oil. Wow. And she gets her clothes from Saggy Maggie's Boutique. Oh, so you've got salted slug flavored toothpaste, washes hair with engine oil, and she buys her clothes from Saggy Maggie's Clothing Shop. Great. Write that down, guys. That's important. We're going to need to know that in the future, just so you guys know. All right, let's go ahead and uh, fill in the uh, puzzle pieces here. Yeah, don't, yeah, we don't want to remove puzzle pieces. Why would we want to remove puzzle pieces? We've got plenty here. They only need two. Yep, treasure trove is next. There we go. Now we just got to find out where that entrance is. That's part of the fun with this game, you know? Grunty's lair isn't just, you know, this small section, you know, 
like you know in the mountains actually a very complex uh tunnel system you know so anyway uh we came from there we can go down this way it looks like so yeah let's go down here real quick this might be where treasure trove cove is oh okay we've got this guy here hello we've activated a magic cauldron find two of the same color to create a shortcut wonderful i love shortcuts You're missing some music notes in Click Clock Wood. Oh, Zach, dude, you, dude, I'm going to tell you right now, man, the same thing happened to me. For the longest time, I could not figure out where the heck, where the heck the, uh, the music notes were. All right, and this is Kazooie's Shock Jump Disc Find Me, and I'll tell you how to use it. Great. It use it is used at the end of the game, Orange. Uh, what is? Oh, someone please tell me how it will help me know what someone uses to brush their teeth. Oh, it's very important, very important. Yeah, believe it or not, it is actually extremely important that you that we know that. Huh? Oh, actually, hold up, hold up, hold up. We want to go down here first. We're gonna kind of explore some of this area here real quick. Dead end, right? Nope, not a dead end. Whoops. Take that guy out and get our health back. I uh, thank you. And then we activate this cauldron here. Not the same color as the other one. Uh, at least I don't think it is, but anyway. And then you got that. That's an invisibility feather that I was telling you guys about earlier. We can't use it right now, though, unfortunately. Oh, nice, a mumbo token. Let's go ahead and pick that up. We'll just go back the way we came. It's just basically a hidden cauldron. That's all it is there. All right, we'll just follow this river down here. Or right, wait, hold up. Let me get rid of this guy first. All right, so there's there's several paths you can go. You can do the Talon Trot, and you can go this way. It's a note door. We need 180 to proceed there, so we're definitely not going to be able to go that way. However, I can jump up here and go through here. Anybody lost yet? <laughs> so yeah, there's not really much anything we can do here. We can't even go up to that platform all the way in the back. There's a mumbo token there as well. And there appears to be another entrance. So yeah, dead end and we can't go this way. It's all blocked off. So there we go. There's only one way to go. We have to go down. So we're going to go down here. There we go. Looks like we've got some uh, eggs here in the water, so we'll go ahead and collect these real quick. Oh, never mind. I guess we're going to go this way first. Hey, uh... Zach, you mentioned uh, Click Clock Wood, right? You remember Click Clock Wood? Here you go. It's cool, man. I remember finding this at the very beginning of the game when I first started playing this, and I was like, "Whoa, what's Click Clock Wood?" And then you go here to the puzzle, right? You try you try to put in puzzle. Well, you can't because there's no there's no puzzle platform here. But at least you could talk to Grunti or Brentilda here, right? All right, so Ugly Grunty's nickname was Jelly Belly at Witch School. Ooh, nice. I also know that Freshly Burst Boils is her favorite smell. Freshly Burst Boils. What? And the old hag's favorite color is Ghastly Gray. Oh, nice. All right, guys. So she was Jelly Belly in Witch School. She loves the smell of freshly burst boils. And her favorite color is ghastly gray. So there you go. Awesome. Go down the waterfall. We did! We went down the waterfall. Now I'm just trying to collect these eggs, but my goodness. It's like I'm I'm, I'm trying to perform art or like freaking precision precision swimming here. 
I don't like stairs much in my lair. They're always make me gasp for air. <laughs> it's because you're out of shape, Grunty. <laughs> Jelly Belly. Hey, isn't that the name of a... Uh... Yeah, it's the name of a... Uh... Yeah, Jelly Belly? Isn't that the name of a, like... Like a... Jelly Bean Company? Ah, uh, let me see here. I think there's something up here. Yeah, there should be something up here. Ah, there is something up here. Great. Good thing I was paying attention. Oh, you help Kazooie fly, eh? Nice. Always good to collect some extra... extra supplies. Ah, oh, come on. And there we go, here we go. Hey, we're getting an Eevee raid. Welcome, raiders. We've got uh, Michelle Douglas, Sketchy Rules, Evan Douglas. Welcome to the live stream. How y'all doing today? Thank you for joining us. I think Alexis Vargas is also part of that raid. Is that correct? Welcome, raiders. Good to have you all on board. Thank you for joining us on today's live stream. By the way, guys, if you don't mind, go ahead and smash that like button. We're one like away from a 30 like hype. Actually, we've already hit 30 likes. Awesome. Thank you, guys. I appreciate that. There we go. Anyway, I always love this stage. This 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 world is uh, definitely uh, one to remember and for several reasons. But I'm going to let you guys basically take it all in as I play uh, through here. It's it's a lot of fun. It really is. It's, it's, it's one of the... Uh, uh, better design stages or worlds in this game for sure. Hey, this is Nipper's Beach. You find nothing without Nipper's help. Help us then, crustacean brain. Grr, cheeky bird need feathers clipping. Uh, feathers clipping. Oh yeah, just try it, shellhead. Well, perhaps maybe if they were nice to him, uh, they they uh, I don't know. He might have helped us. Oh, there we go. Eh, we're just gonna wait. There we go. Alright, I think one more hit ought to do him in, so... There we go. There we go. <laughs> nice! I unlocked an achievement. Awesome. Let's go ahead inside. Oh, you're not feeling well there, uh, Mason? I'm sorry to hear that, man. I hope you feel better. Elif Yildrum, welcome to live stream. How's it going? I'm glad to have you here. Thanks for, uh, thanks for being here. Oh, you just came in? You weren't part of the raid? No worries. Sorry for the confusion there, Alexis. Oh, that's right, this guy. <laughs> I'm gonna collect these notes first. All right, so go talk to this guy, see what his deal is. Ahoy there, I'm Cap'n Blubber, and I lost my treasure when me ship crashed. Well, go find it then, Blubber Guts. Arr, but I can't swim. Ye can ye help an old sea hippo? Sure, we'll find it for you. Easy enough, right? Oh, 
All right, if you hold down A, it actually makes it easier for you to, to swim in the water more uh, subtly, if you will. All right, so we need to find a way to get to the other side there. Doesn't look easy. Jeremiah in three two three. Welcome, welcome to the live stream. How's it going, buddy? Thanks for joining us. The salty hippo is the name of the ship. <laughs> All right, is it down there? Yep, there it is. Or at least I think it is. Yeah, I think that's going to be the entrance right there. There we go. So now we're on the other side of that partition, and we're gonna get the rest of the musical notes that are down here. Ugh. So many music notes that we need to collect. Oh shoot, I'm stuck. I don't think there's anything else in here. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We can go ahead and leave now. Great. Uh, go back up. Go back up. There we go. You have a bad headache? Oh man, that sucks, dude. I'm gonna see what he says. Hey, got your gold, man. Mid treasure! Thank you, me heartaches. Thank you. Take this reward. Nice. So we got our first jiggy, or second jiggy in this world. Awesome. So he hooks us up, and he's out of here. Great. All right, so now we're going to learn how to fly. This is your big chance, chicken legs. It's time for you to fly. At last. It better be easy, Bo uh, guys. Simple enough even for you, bird brain. Just stand on a flying disc and press A. Here's 25 red feathers to help you into the air. Thank you. Appreciate that, buddy. Got to grab this uh, Mumbo's token real quick. There we go. All right, now we can go fly. Oh, nope. Oops. So this one's not easy. Oh no! Ah. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, that's right. That's right. Get out of here. Get out of the water. Get out of the water. Get out of the water. His name's Snacker, really? <laughs> nice. Oh. oh, dang, there's a bunch of uh, music notes over there. Shoot. I just noticed them, too. Dang, man. There we go. Got it. Ha 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 ha! 
All right, I gotta get that Jinjo that's up there on the pole. Working on the Minecraft realm there? Oh, you're getting a headache. What? You're getting a headache because you're working on the Minecraft realm so much. Maybe, maybe you should take a break from that there, Mason. Just saying. Just saying there, buddy. There we go. All right, so now we're on 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 the top of the uh, the island here. Ooh, don't fall. Alright, so now we just need to make our way uh, to the top here. Oh no! I'm supposed to. Uh, dang it! I gotta talk to Bottles. We gotta, we gotta get that. Uh, what's it called? We gotta learn how to use that jump pad. All right, so we won't be using that anytime soon. Oh shoot! I was too close. I was too close. But that's fine. That's fine. We we got rid of him. So. Now another thing that I like about Treasure Trove is uh, you know it's big enough to where they they give you plenty of room to learn how to fly, uh, you know, and, and get good at flying in this game before you know you move on to the different worlds that require. Uh, you know, flying. Alright, so I see three more notes there that we need to get, so we'll go ahead and get these. That'll put us at 33, so only 77 more to, to get. Oh, shoot. Why did it do that? Alright. Oh, no. Not again. There we go. There's more than one way to get the, get a jiggy. And we are way up there, man. Look at this. This is basically this is basically the world. Oh shoot, it won't let me it won't let me zoom in. Wonder why it won't let me zoom in. That's weird. Does anybody know how to zoom in to where I can actually look at the world? I wonder why uh, I can't zoom in. Oh, nice. Totally forgot about that. Yeah, that's a thing. <laughs> Speaking of that, uh, let's see here. Oh, you and Octo George are up until midnight working on a wall around the village? That's great. Awesome. I can't wait to see it, dude. Right, there we go. Get these three tokens here. We're at 41 tokens now. Let's see, can I even make it over there? Uh oh. Oh, that was a bad, bad move. Probably should not have done that. Oh well. Alright, so I need to find bottles so I can learn all the different move sets that we need to learn here in this game. 
Oops. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. No, 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 no. Dang. That sucks. What a waste. Alright, so that's the entrance. We've already been there. So we've only found one of, uh... One of the spots where we need to learn stuff from bottles. He's not over here. So we'll go the other way. Those clams are annoying. I agree, uh, Matt. Ah, here we go. We found him. You'll reach new heights with my shock jump spring. Does Kazooie do it? My legs are tired. Don't worry, the turkey does all the work. Simply stand on a shock jump disc, then press on hold A. Mmm, your energy is a little low. I'll fill it for up for you. Thanks, man, I appreciate that. Nice going, you've learned all the cove's new moves. Really, that's it? Wow. Nice, we got that token. Shoot, gotta start over. I hate starting over. Final plays. What is going on? Welcome to live stream, buddy. Thank you for joining us. How you doing? It says me leaky, no good for water. Can bear block hole with pebbles. No. Leaky patched up now. Empty water for bear. Nice. Awesome. All right. Uh, does anybody does anybody know the code here for this? Everball, you're looking wise. Solve my puzzle and win a prize. Okay. Anybody know what the uh, solution is? The spelling puzzle? Yeah, I don't know what it is. Yeah, you guys tell me. Alright. Let's see here. It's on the wall. Oh, Banjo-Kazooie. Ha. Ha ha ha. Ha. Alright. So we'll do that. Oh, he cut me down to size, all right. There we go. How many more is that? Two more? Nope. <laughs> five more. We got to get five more. Yeah, we're already we're already learning all of her secrets there. Final plays. We've learned six of them already.
Oh, excuse me. There we go. Four more to go. Awesome. It probably would have helped if we saw where we were landing, but that's okay. We can just climb back up. By the way, guys, thank you so much for 30 likes. If you're just now joining us, if you haven't already hit that like button, do me a favor and hit that like button. Let me know that you guys are enjoying this retro kind of content. Let me know if you guys want to see more content like this in the future. I would appreciate it. Dang it, man. The retro game contest is nice. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad you guys are enjoying it. Oh, nice. We got a token back here. Go and grab that. Actually, there's one behind the uh, crab, the crab shell. Yeah, I almost forgot about that. I should probably grab that. Nice. Full health. Dang it. Oh, you can shoot eggs at the shark? What? I did not know that. Seriously, I thought I thought he was like impervious. Like you could not hurt him. That's the first time I've heard of that. Thank you. Uh, thank you for letting me know. There we go. We made it to safety. Awesome. And I see something over there. There we go.
Alright, there we go. So we unlocked all the Jinjos. Alright, we got another one. Did I help Blubber already? Yes, I did there, final. Yep, we already hooked him up. He's got his gold back. Now he's going to go buy his jet ski. Oh, no. No. Get out of there. Go, go, go. There we go. I managed to survive that ordeal. I don't know how, but I managed. Nice. What about Grunty's treasure? Yeah, we just picked it up. Yeah, the one that's in the, uh, in the, uh, um, oh gosh. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, the treasure chest. Yeah, under the mountain. Yeah, we got it. Alright, is there anything down there? You know what? Best to just check. Yep, there we go. Another jiggy. Alright, so there. We got that. Ooh, there we go. Could always use more of those. Alright, let's move on. Yeah, we are definitely 100%ing this game. Or at least that is the plan. I am so tempted to get that one honeycomb, but uh, not gonna happen. <laughs> not gonna happen. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! That was a mistake. That was a mistake. That was a mistake. Should have stayed. Just should have stayed on land. There we go. Back this way. Uh, just feathers over there. Oh, that's what I wanted to get. Yeah, we need to get that. We need to get that. Ah. Uh. Why will this not let me... Does anybody know how to get it to where I could go into uh, first person view? I'm trying to get into first person view and it never lets me. Alright, the D-pad doesn't seem to be working either. Mr. Mike the Gamer, what is up dude? Welcome to the stream, good to have you. Also, guys, thank you for 33 likes. We've got 19 of you watching the show right now. You guys are awesome. Yeah, again, if you know anyone else that would like to join us on tonight's live stream, let them know. Let them know that we're live right now and have them come on by and join us today. Dang, I still got to find 20 more musical notes. Holy cow, man. I don't even know where they all are. Oh, what is this? Let me guess, Kazoo's got a... I don't even know.
Aw, oh, shoot. <laughs> Was it worth it? Was it worth it? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, that was a close one. All right, maybe I use the uh, build, the uh, drill beak. Yeah, we'll try that. I'm gonna take a quick shower. All right, take care, night, uh, Nathan. We'll be here, buddy. Follow the clues. Alright, so I imagine we're probably going to have to... Oh, there it is. Good thing we're not on a timer here. As right, so we go this way. Ah, there it is. Oh, once you get all the X's, it gives you a piece. Nice. I'll never find the next one. What? It's kind of messed up, yo. Oh, I found, I found some notes. I found some notes in the trees, guys. And on some land bridges. Great. Okay, so we found the remaining notes that I wasn't able to uh, uh, collect. So that's good. I just need to do. Uh, just need to climb some trees. That's what I needed to do. Easy enough. Ah! Oh, stop! Stop with this madness! Stop falling off the tree! Oh, stop falling off the tree! Stop! Collect the note, Banjo! Oh my god! Ah! Mason, what's your question, buddy? Just ask, man. Just ask. No, no, no need to, to ask if you can ask. Just ask. Oh, nine more to go! Ah, nice. Yep, we got them all, guys. All the notes. Outstanding. Alright, so we've got 200 notes so far in the game. Awesome. It right, says I will never find the next one. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Yikes, please open me gently, he says. <laughs> Why did I spam the feathers? Uh, because I can. <laughs> it just weighs like 10. And my, my response to that is, who cares? Who cares? Oh, 
Did I open Bubble Goop Swamp? Come on, Final. I just started playing this game, man. <laughs> no, I didn't open Bubble Goop Swamp yet. Dude, we just started. <laughs> we just started. Yeah, Clicker's Cabin. Yeah, I believe that is next to Zach. That's your second favorite world? What's your first favorite world there, Zach? Be careful with the shark. Uh, we're nowhere near a shark there, Mason. I, th I think you might want to uh, refresh the screen there, man. I think, I, think, I think your live stream might be a little delayed. I believe there's another note door here. Yeah, there is. What was it, 260? Yep. Oh, wow. I couldn't move from that spot. Oh, look, it's her. All right, so my lazy sister often sleeps in a dumpster, the dirty hag. Wow. And the only thing she's ever won was the dirtiest undies competition at witch school. Oh, no, that is gross. She often boasts of appearing on the cover of Fat Hag Monthly, posing in her long johns. What? No way. <laughs> oh my gosh. I hope somebody's taking notes because I, I am not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm, I'm just, I'm just, yeah, I'm just, yeah, oh my god, ew. <laughs> I know that. Wait, hold on a second. What do we got in here? We got... Oh, we can't use those. Hey, keep your feet out! Can't use us until you've spoken to bottles. Oh. Well, thanks for nothing. Alright, we are not going to be able to go into there anytime soon. So there there goes that idea. All right, let's take a look at our stats here real quick. Let's see here. View totals. Uh, Gruntoodle's Lair. Spiral Mountain. Yeah, and then there's game total. Got all those. Great. I went the wrong way. I'm supposed to go this way. Wait, whoops. Mama's Mountain. Good. Treasure Trove Cove. Good. But, uh, how do we unlock Bubble Goop Swamp? I can't go that way because I don't got the boots. I'll get eaten alive by piranhas. Oh, no, I'll, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and find it on my own first final, and then I'll uh, ask people for help. Yeah, I'll usually solicit for help if I uh, am really having trouble. And I and trust me, guys, I will have trouble in, uh, in, in the future, in future live streams of this game, because it is hard. It gets harder. Yeah, it definitely gets harder. Let's see. Hmm. Alright, so if it's not here, then we need to go backwards. Back the way we came. 
Everything so far? Great! Yeah, we're on track. That's good. I like being on track. We know that that leads to Click Clock Wood. Alright, that's Treasure Trove Cove. So we climb up this vine here. Let me go up this way. So we go up this way, and I believe there should be a switch around here somewhere. Right? Harder, harder, harder. Yes, it does get difficult. Yeah, see, these are down. So we're not going that way. There's got to be a switch somewhere around here. Rusty Bucket Bay. Oh, indeed, indeed, indeed. Rusty Bucket Bay. I do, I do like me some Rusty Bucket Bay, though. Rusty Bucket Bay definitely has a, a place in, in, in my heart. And, 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 and by that, I mean I absolutely hate how hard it is. It is not a fun stage, by no measure. You guys will find out here eventually. Okay, so so far so good. We're making we're making some progress, so that's good. All right, give me that mumbo token, yo. Ekumpokum. All right. Great. Hey, by the way, did you guys know that Doctor Disrespect is back to live streaming? Yeah. Yeah, he's back on YouTube. Yeah, he live streamed today. I don't know if any of you guys caught his broadcast. I was not able to because, you know, I was out at SeaWorld with the fam fam. Yep, we were, uh, you know, having a, you know, some fun at SeaWorld today. It's the reason why I had to start my live stream a little late. We got home a little late, but I hope you guys uh, understand. So, oh, hey, look, we get to talk to her again. Great. Give us the facts. Grunty wears massive bloomers under that repulsive dress of hers. Really, you don't say. She's also got this nasty pet dog whose name is Big Naka. We never see that dog. My sister sings in her own band, Grunty and the Monster Mob. They're awful, I bet. No! Oh! Ah, oh, dang it. No, get away, get away, get away. Nathan Byberg, welcome back. Welcome back, Nathan Byberg. Welcome back to the stream. How's everybody doing in the chat today? Hope you guys are doing good. Aha! Clanker's Cavern. Here we go. Oh, no, wait, this is, uh... Yeah, this is Bubble Goop Swamp. This is the puzzle for the uh, Bubble Goop Swamp, isn't it? Yep, sure is. Because we'll be going to Clanker's Cavern next. I thought it was Clanker's Cavern for some reason. I slept for, like, six hours earlier, though. Really, really Sonic Pikachu. By the way, Sonic Pikachu, thanks for being here, buddy. There we go, right trigger. <laughs> nice. Easy enough. Alright, time for some bubble gloop swamp. You say hunt down the Clanker's Cavern puzzle? Well, I I have my suspicions. Uh, final. I I think I think the next or the only way that we'll be able to access that one is if we uh, 
go through Bubble Goop Swamp, learn how to use those boots, and then uh, we'll access uh, the puzzle area for for that. See, I want that. I want that jiggy, but I can't get it right now because it's it's behind bars. Jump! Yeah, it's going to be through there, but we need to use the boots, and we do not have access to those boots yet. So to Bubble, Glo Bubble Gloop Swamp we go. Keep your eyes open for your new moves. Oh, I forgot what this guy does, but uh, I'm going to just entertain this real quick. Alright, so he's gonna move on us. Great. Me want yummy egg too, great. Alright, so I guess we'll be feeding those guys. <laughs> Alright, here we go. These are the wading boots. Chicken Legs wears them so you can safely wade through dangerous areas. Like the swamp for a limited time. Okay, Chicken Er Kazooie, let's go grab a pair. Great, now you know all the swamp's new moves. What? That's it? Wow. That was easy. Alright, let's go back in here real quick. I'm just gonna go back in here. No. Oh, that's right. We got to deal with those guys now. Oh, it's the freeze easy peak thing. No. Well, that answers that question. All right, I have 13 pieces. Great. And right, so we unlocked that. It'll be a while before we get there. But yeah, that's freeze easy peak. So there we go. We unlocked that. I believe there's an ice key up here. I'm not sure. Nah, just the uh, invisibility thing. Hmm, we are definitely not going in there. I think you have to be the crocodile. I think the crocodile is the only way you can get in there. Oh, shoot. We need boots. There we go. Hey, Lemmy, what's up, dude? All right, let's go back to Bubble Gloop. Yeah, I gotta do this thing again. Oh, you want a yummy egg too? Well, you can't have it! Oh, that's right, I got Max. Got Max! Max Feathers. I might as well use these. Grab a mumbo token. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, shoot. Uh, this is piranha water. Simply... <laughs> I... Okay. Ah, nice. So they give us that. Great. And we have 45 seconds to get it. Awesome. Dang it. No! We're in trouble. Okay. Oh, shoot, they got me. <laughs> hey, Mr. Smile More DJ with the $1 donation. Thank you so much, buddy. I appreciate it. Dang, those guys are hard to hit. Ah, uh, get off. All right, let's try this again. No. Dang it. There we go, we got him. Nice, our first one. Now we can just take our time going back. No! Ah, uh, dang it. Ah, uh, I don't want to mess with those guys right now. This should open up that gate in Gruntilda's lair. There it is. Yep, we got it. Perfect. There we go. Another jiggy. Hey, Jamie Kleinkoff, welcome. How's it going? Thanks that thanks for having or thanks for coming by. Shoot. It's been a while. There we go, got it. Alright, once again guys, don't forget to smash that like button.
Alright, we need we need boots. We need them boots. We have no boots. Where are they at? Alright, really can't deal with these guys right now. Don't have enough health. Ah, oh, shoot. Those were short-lived. There we go. We got some extra health now. That's good. Let me see, did I miss anything up here? I don't think I did. I think that's everything. Oh, that's right, the token. We gotta get that. My feet are so numb and cold. Okay. Well, I've got a solution. <laughs> ah, that's a bit better. <laughs> Let's do that two more times, right, guys? <laughs> Tanked up's warm at last. Perhaps you'd like this. Sure. Sound sounds good. Sounds good. Best of sound effect in the whole game. I know, right? It's like why couldn't they use that more often? So I, I I can't think of any other scene in this game where they actually use it again. So ouch. We need some health. We need some more health. Dang it. Dang. I think I have to learn... Do I have to learn the invisibility? Invincibility? Oh, no. I don't think that's it. I really don't think that's it. Oh, if you talk to Bottles, he'll give you a life. Thank <laughs> you. 
You're too tough for us, Flibbits. Take, take our gold. Yep, there we go. Awesome. Don't have to worry about those guys no more. There's a memory game in there, in inside the turtle. Great. Where's he at? Ah, oh, there he is. Oh no! <laughs> Sorry. I'd collect everything here while I'm here. Alright, let's see here. <laughs> Quiet, please. The famous Tip Top Choir will now perform my latest work. A bit short, isn't it, Shellboy? Elsie, copy what you just heard for lesson one. Not too bad. Try lesson two. All right, that guy. Oops. All right, which one was next? This one right here? And then this one back here. Uh, need more lesson, okay. Purple guy, red guy, uh, that guy, blue guy, dark purple. Ah, oh, jeez. Then this guy, and this guy, and then, geez, was it this one? The blue one? And then this one. Oh, dude, it hurt me. No! Oh, shoot, I'm losing life. Time to break out the pen and paper. <laughs> Alright, hopefully I get it right this time. No. Oh, shoot. 
Ah, oh, no. No! <laughs> Gotta love bubble gloop, uh, bubble gloop swamp, right guys? It's the best. Nothing like Bubble Gloop Swamp. Oh, that's right, he's this way. Did he call him racing? Yeah, it is. It's Tip Tup. This guy right here is Tank Tup. And then Tip Tup's the composer. Ah, I got careless. Try this. Hopefully, I get it right. Oh, nice. Uh, true masterpiece here. Take this trinket I found earlier. Oh, uh, it's not just any trinket, buddy. That's a jiggy. Awesome. So we successfully managed to get through that. That's good. Nice. Thanks, DJ. Appreciate it, buddy. Hey, Tark Terry. What's up, dude? Hey, Tark, tell me. What do you know about uh, this game, Banjo-Kazooie? Have you played this game before? I probably should have saved that. Oh well! Alright, time to traverse these nasty, nasty piranha infested waters. Oh, I suppose we can go here next. Uh, you're in the last battle with Grunty, Tark, oh. Thought he was talking to me. I miss playing this on the N64, my brother and I, t uh, tag team this. Yeah. It was a fun game back then, uh, uh, Jamie, I, I agree. It's a lot of fun. Oh man, where to next? Alright, so we got four more notes. We gotta find two of those... 
uh, honeycomb things and four jiggies. All right, let's get back to it. Dang, man. Where the heck is Mumbo's place? Mumbo's place has got to be around here somewhere, man. Ah, that's a dead end. Been that way before. Guess we'll go this way. Yeah, I don't think we uh, covered this area yet. shoot. Gotta try and get through this maze. Come on, come on. There we go. Almost there. Or at least I hope we're almost there. <laughs> oh, shoot. Nope, I need that. Ooh, we made it just in time. Good. Oh, I bet it's another one of those timed events. It is! Wonderful! No! No! Ooh, man, that was close. That was close. Alright, they're gonna make me... They're gonna make me try to get it again. That's right, Zach Carbon, you're absolutely right. He does he does turn you into a crocodile. No! No, no we gotta get to safety. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. I was going the wrong way the whole time. No! I thought I could make it! Uh-oh, we're in trouble. 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 Dang. Oh, uh... On where Mumbo is? I know he's here somewhere. Gosh, man, isn't the swamp the worst? Can't go that way unless you're a crocodile. Actually, uh, oh, there's Mumbo's place. Mumbo's place is at the end of this tunnel. Or not tunnel, maze. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. There we go. We made it. Ooh, that was close. Ah, 
Hey, it's Mumbo's place. And we made it. Whoa, what? Oh, you jerk. Ah. Actually, let me go up here first. Ah, uh, it's just... Oh, wait, there we go. Dang it. No! You're supposed to get that. Get the... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Why am I having such trouble? There we go. All right, we need one more. One more, and then we will have another hell. This is your favorite transformation spot? Indeed. I love this, because I, I get to fight things now. Wait, Mumbo need new, new boots. Uh, no, uh, that's funny. He says, wait, Mumbo need new boots because of alligator? Alligator skin? Get it? No, don't get it. Now, the great thing about being a gator right now is you don't have to worry about, uh, you know, getting bit by uh, piranhas. So we can actually uh, navigate the swamp. No problem. <laughs> awesome. Alright, just so you guys know, I'm going to try and uh, finish this world um, as quickly as possible. We're going to try to, uh, you know, get everything that we need here once we're done with it. Nice. I love that. Got him in the air. Perfect. But yeah, I want to finish this world um, and then we will, uh, we will go ahead and go on a raid. So I hope you guys stick around for that. I don't quite want to go in there just yet. I want to go ahead and head towards the uh, the side where I thought we would need the boots, but yeah. Yeah, right over here. We need to collect all this stuff. All this stuff needs to go. Well, not go, but we need to collect it. Oh, is that the last one? I wonder if this is the last Jinjo. Nope, we still need to collect one more. One more Jinjo. Right, I think we're maxed out there. Oh, nice. Extra life. Alright, we need to buy nine more musical notes, guys. Nine more. I'm hoping they'll be inside that gator. Oh, I maxed out on gold. Yeah, the frozen area. Yeah, to unlock uh, the next, the next uh, area. Ninety-four. Oh man. Three more. Oh, jeez, we need to find three more musical notes. Here we go. Mr. Vile, greediest croc of all. Play my game to win a prize. Press A to accept or B to chicken out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Need more red, uh, yep. You only win easy game, now we play harder game. Eat reds, avoid yellow grumblies, they not ripe. Alright. Ah, one again. Nice. Ah, lucky greeny wins. Must play last game. Only eat what is shown at top of screen. Ah, oh, what? Wow, what a jerk. Oh, no, no, no. I ate the wrong one. No. Oh, we're in trouble, guys. Dang. I think I gotta exit and then re enter. Alright, only show what is he yep, on screen. Right. Easy, right? Dude, they're popping up where he can get them. Oh, that's messed up. Thank <laughs> you. 
No, he beat me again. Dang, man. That sucks. No. Come on. Ah, oh, dang it. Ah, uh, they changed it on me again. There we go, we got him. Great. Okay, so now we're good. Uh, no, we're not gonna do that. Alright, so that's been handled. Don't have to worry about that. I gotta. I still gotta find three notes. Third time's the charm. I know, right, Zach? I still gotta find three musical notes. Uh, what Splatfest team? I'm gonna be on Team Chicken. Yeah, I'm on Team Chicken there, Tark. Yeah, I don't want to be on Team Scrambled Egg. Hey, Nate, what's up, man? All right, well, you're you're free to hang out with us, man. Yeah, I'm trying to I'm trying to complete uh, Bubble Gloop Swamp. I'm trying to get all the all the jiggies, the honeycomb, and uh, let's see here. Yeah, we've got one more honeycomb that we need to get. We need two more jiggies and three more musical notes. So. That's where we're at right now. Oh, and one more Jinjo. Need to find the final Jinjo. Team Chicken for the win. That's right. That's right. You can't have an egg without a chicken. I'm just saying. Dude, where else is there that we need to go? Anybody know? Anybody? Oh, that's right. I gotta go feed those uh, crocodile thingies. But well, that's okay. I'm just gonna go this way. <laughs> nice. Did I check the far right? Uh, probably not. All right. You 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 mean uh, from the uh, from the starting point, right? Yeah, let me let me exit the world first because we we've, we've got to go get that secret. I'm gonna do that real quick. Yeah, we're gonna go up here. If I remember correctly, this is gonna be Cheeto. Is this Cheeto? Might be Cheeto. Oh, maybe not. Yep, it's Cheeto. Cheeto the Spellbook. You have found magic cheats I have for you. 
Hey, Book Brain! What did you say? You better not give my spells away. Which lost book finders, bear, and bird are spell they get. We sure do, bag lady. Come on, book boy, give us the spells. Only one spell Cheeto can tell. Enter the code blue eggs on sandcastle floor and treasure trove cove world. Help you it will. Hidden in lair. Other spell books are. Them you should find. Great. Alright, so there's that. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything else here. Let's move on. Mason is lurking. Yeah, that's what he does. Yeah, if you enter blue eggs, it will give you more blue eggs. That's good. Yep, I'm a crocodile now. Yep. No longer is it Banjo-Kazooie. It's, it's Banjo-Croc. Banjo-Crocodile. That's the name of the game. Alright, so it's not here. I'm trying to find those music notes, man. Oh, there they are. They're over there. Yeah, there's three of them. They're right up there. So I guess I need to get rid of the uh, the spell. So we'll just have uh, we'll have Mumbo change us back. Hey, real quick, somebody find out if I need to be crocodile form in order to unlock the next world. What was the original on, and what are you playing it on? The original was on the Nintendo 64. We are playing it on the Xbox One. Nice, you made it to a 40 like hype. That's awesome, guys. Thank you so much for that. I appreciate it. Yeah, just so you guys know, uh, you know, when we do the next episode, we are definitely not going to be able to beat this in, uh, or well, we won't be able to do three worlds uh, in, in one episode like I did today. It'll probably take us uh, a couple of episodes um, to do one world, essentially, because that's, that's how difficult the game gets um, as we progress through the game. There we go. Right into the piranha infested swamp. Nice. Oh, there he is. There's the other Jinjo. Nice. Alright, so we found that Jinjo. Octo George, 1101, welcome to the stream. Okay, so we, we've reached a conundrum. Uh, I am missing one, one, one gold jiggy, guys. 
We are missing one gold jiggy. And I don't know where it is. Somebody find out where the tenth gold jiggy is, because I don't even remember where it was. Oh wait, I know what it is. I know what it is. Those uh those crocodiles. The the gold crocodiles. Supposed to feed them eggs. I forgot about that. I think we got to do this a couple of times. Yeah, do I need to be crocodile form uh, in Gruntilda's lair to unlock the next world? Does anybody know? Yeah, we might actually go for three hours now that, now that I'm looking at the clock. We might we might go for three. Dang, all the way up there? Shoot. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Jeez, man. Nice. Nice. Very cool. <sighs> Gotta love Bubble Gloop Swamp. Oh my gosh, it's the best. Bubble Gloop Swamp is the best. The best around. No! <laughs> no! Ah, what the heck? Yes! We get to start all over again. I love it. I love it. This is amazing. I love this gimmick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Croc just likes, and then the other one wants it too. Yay. Ugh. Ugh. Oh! 
Almost done, guys. Almost done. Shulk9, what's up? Welcome. How's it going? Oh, come on. Ugh. Okay, so where is the last honeycomb? Yeah, where's the last honeycomb at? Anybody know? Yeah, because when we view the totals, this is where I'm at. I'm missing one! No! Where is the last honeycomb? I need it! So I could extend my life. Yeah, somebody find out for me. Inquiring minds want to know. Five Nights at Freddy's anniversary is tomorrow? Oh, how many years? How many years has it been? Five years? Wow. Five years for Five Nights at Freddy's. Awesome. I guess I should look it up. I guess I wasn't paying attention when I went inside uh, Tank Tup. I was so busy trying to figure out how to do uh, Tip Tup's little musical thing that I wasn't looking around inside. So we're gonna we're gonna get it now. After we get this honeycomb piece, this will be it for uh, for Bubble Goo Loop Swamp. Should be over here somewhere. 
There it is. Nice. All right, very good. So now, now we're good. So we've 100% uh, bubble gloop swamp. So we're good to go there. Oh, whoops, wrong way. Still remember when FNAF 2 getting released good old times, yeah. Yeah, I still haven't played that one. Get the heck out of here. I want to at least unlock Clanker's cl uh, Cavern. I mean, even, is that even the next stage? Clanker's Cavern? Thanks for the GG's, guys. Aha, there we go, 260. We have 300 notes, so we should be able to unlock this door. There we go. It's the next stage because you get the invincibility move. Nice. Yeah, see, this looks like Gobi's Arena to me. Oh, nice. This should be... Ah, switch. Another switch. Oh, it activates... That thing, so that's good. Awesome. All right, so that takes us in there. Great. So that takes care of that. All right, so back this way. Kazoo crew coming through. What? Welcome. Welcome, Raiders. Welcome to live stream. How y'all doing today? Great to have you all on board. Thank you for joining us on today's live stream. 64 Teddy, RQ Donut. Hello, welcome. Welcome to live stream. How you guys doing today? Welcome to all the Raiders. Yeah, we're definitely not going to be going that way. We have no way of getting through there. We have nothing. Oh, we could potentially go to Freeze Easy Peak if we wanted to. We could do that. If we wanted to. And this one right here, 450. No way we're going there. So just to give you guys an idea of how massive this place is. All right, let's talk to Brentilda again. Infinity 1170. Beastman 617. Nico Tuna. Awesomeness 251. 
Welcome to all the raiders coming in on the live stream. How's it going? How y'all doing today? Thank you for joining us. Then she usually ha- whoops. Warp bags, then finishes with cockroaches and cream for dessert. How horrid. Okay, I gotta read all the other stuff again. The disgusting Gruntilda has tat- wait, 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 what? No Aww, why do I hit- I keep hitting the wrong button. Sorry, guys. The disgusting Gratilda has tadpoles on toast for breakfast. Great. What else? Then she usually has slug stew for dinner. Yuck. Wart hags then finishes with cockroaches and cream for dessert. How horrid. Well, that is disgusting. Yep. Classy lad, what is up, man? Welcome to the live stream. How's it going? Oh, we can't go that way. Nothing, nothing going on there. I don't think there's anything back here. Oh, I was wrong. I stand corrected. There is an extra life, so that's good. But yeah, Gruntilda's lair is not a small place. It's uh, it's it's pretty big. It's pretty big. And for those of you who may have played Ukulele, you know that's another game. Ouch! That. Uh, Oof. Alright, well, I guess I'll go in here real quick. Here we go. Don't think you can use these. You found out how. Oh, shoot. So we won't be using that anytime soon. Great. I love it how, like, there's so many things in this game that we cannot utilize yet because, well, you know, limitations. Yep. We broke that. Anyway, if you guys want to see what the mural looks like, this is what it is. Yeah, Banjo Kazooie and Freeze Easy Peak. I believe over there is supposed to be. Oh, I guess he's not here. All right, there we go. Welcome back. Good to have you. All right, so let's head back. So the Yellow Kazoo is here. Welcome, Yellow Kazoo. Good to have you on board. Thank you for joining us. We're playing your uh, favorite character's game, or your Smash Brothers main. Or your Smash Brothers main. We're playing his game, or her, his and her game, <laughs> because you know it's it's both Banjo and Kazooie. Can't forget that. But yeah, we're just uh, trying it out. Trying to one hundred percent it. Okay, we just came from here. Great. Why does why does Grunty have a banjo and kazooie? Uh, you know that is a very good question. I myself have never been able to get the answer to that. I, I have questioned that. Yeah, just one of those things, man. Oh wait, we just we just came from there. Shoot. All right. In all seriousness, are we supposed to go to Freeze Easy Peak next? I believe this is Gopi's Valley. Ah, Gopi's Valley. <laughs> Grunty's best friend at witch school was the awful Saggy Maggie. <laughs> When relaxing, she usually reads Big Butts and Guts magazine. While sipping a glass of her favorite smoothie elephant sweat. Oh, you poor dears. Your energy is low. Let me fill it up for you. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. That's awesome. Hey, Wesley Dunnigan. Welcome to live stream, buddy. Good to have you. Thanks for joining us.
All right, so I don't think Clanker's Cavern, uh, Cavern is next. Does anybody know? Like, for real. <laughs> when are we supposed to go to Clanker's Cavern? I feel like I might have made a mistake. I feel like we missed something, you know? Like, seriously. When do we go to Clanker's Cavern? Elephant Sweat, yeah. Yeah, we'll have to go and remind ourselves all of all of those, uh, you know, secrets uh, in the future. I, I really think it has to do with this spot. You know, I think Clanker's Cavern is around here somewhere. I think you skipped that one. Really? Great! Oh, Treasure Trove Cove? Really? I feel like... I feel like it should be over here somewhere. Clanker's Cavern, I mean. You know? I already talked to her. That's right, we already opened this. Oh, this is the uh, Bubble Gloop Swamp. Uh, yeah, this this should be for Bubble Gloop Swamp. Yeah, it's Bubble Gloop Swamp. Yeah, we don't need to worry about this. So we're gonna go back. It's usually before Bubble Gloop Swamp. Ah. For the jump pad. Okay. So we gotta go backwards. So back towards Treasure Trove Cove. So somewhere in this room. Ah, here we go. Yes. Aha, there it is. So we wound up going to the fourth world before the third world. That's what happened. Yeah, Clanker's Cavern was supposed to be the uh, the third world. There we go. So that that solves that. Great. Awesome. I'm gonna play for about 15 more minutes, guys, and then we're gonna go uh, raid another channel. I think a good three-hour start's probably good for this game series. So. Okay, we, I guess we won't be going up that way. Great. All right, check out Cl uh, good old Clanker's Cavern. Just the one new move to find in this time, but it's hidden well. Uh-oh. Why is it hidden well? Jinjo. Oh shoot. Oh, that's right. We don't have piranhas to worry about here. Great. Yeah, I don't think there's anything over there that we need. Alright, so we'll go back this way. Gotta watch out for those guys. Alright, 
Alright, so we're going underwater. theme song's really good. Yeah, it's not bad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I almost ruined it there. But yeah, so imagine, you know, swimming through this pipe, right, to get to the other side, and then the first thing staring you down in as you, as you come to the end of the pipe is a pair of teeth. I am Clanker, which is garbage grinder. Clanker, not like dirty water. Want fresh air. We don't need to go down there. Let's uh, head down here real quick. I believe he's. Yep, yeah, he's. Yeah, we need to, we need to release him. So we're gonna go down here first. I think that's the, the the one thing that we're gonna do before we sign off. Let's take care of this real quick. this camera. There we go. We're lucky to have that guy down here, that's for sure. Oh shoot, I drowned. Oh shoot, I wasn't paying attention. I thought I had more time. <laughs> I thought I had more time. Alright. And splash around enough to find the new move there. Yep, we sure didn't. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah, it's all right. We will uh, we'll, we'll, we'll come back to it uh, another time. We'll definitely come back to it another time. I'm going to head back to Spiral Mountain real quick. I want to show you guys something. Something I forgot to uh, show you guys the uh, when we first started this game. You thought there was no time limit underwater? Oh, there is. There is. There's definitely a time limit. Check this out. You can go back into Banjo's house at any time. Uh, I don't remember if it's this one. Let's see. Well, hey, you found my secret moving picture game. Complete this puzzle and you can win a mystery prize. Great. It better be good, Soil Brain. 
All right, here we go. There we go. It was easy, Beetle Breath. What do we win? Uh, I'll tell you. Use the tiles on the floor of the sandcastle in Treasure Trove Cove to spell the word bottles bonus one. Great. So there's that. And then there's additional. Uh, you can also try level two on my game if you like. Just one look at the picture again. Gotcha. Well, that's good. But yeah, this is Banjo's house, guys. So for those of you that, uh, you know, wanted to get a better look inside his house, this is what it looks like. So yeah, there you go. All right, so let's go ahead and see if we can't find a raid target. I'm going to go do that right now. In the meantime, guys, uh, the Yellow Kazoo, she, uh, you know, raided our channel. We also got a raid from uh, another channel, although uh, they didn't really stick around for very long to, you know, tell me who they were or what they were live streaming. But yeah, I appreciate the raids. It's very awesome of them to do that. So guys, yes, please take the opportunity to check out the Yellow Kazoo's channel. She was kind enough to raid my channel, so yes, please do that. I don't think there's anybody else live streaming Banjo Kazooie, but it's always good to check. You know, always good to see if somebody else is live streaming it. If not, we can always raid uh, somebody, you know, playing another game. Not a big deal. <laughs> That's funny. All right, so give me a moment, guys, while we look. I don't think anybody else is. Well, shoot. Who am I supposed to raid then? Well, it looks like Papa Agron is uh, live streaming this game, so I guess we can go raid his channel. Yeah, he's live right now. So, one second, guys. Oh, wow, he's he's much further into the game than I am. Alright, guys, so we're going to go raid Papa Agron. He's live streaming Banjo-Kazooie. Yeah. The, uh, yes, I agree, Shulk9. They're absolutely, uh, absolutely hilarious. Alright, the name of the channel is Papa Agron. We're gonna use hashtag, uh, Clark Raid in the chat. Uh, no need to spam it or anything, guys. Just, uh, you know, be respectful. Here's the link to his live stream that is in progress. Again, that's hashtag Clark Raid. I would appreciate it. So yeah, head over there, go support that streamer if you don't mind. Use that link to get there. DJ, thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. Mr. Smilemore, DJ, going in there. Zach Carmen, thank you so much. Mason, thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. Oh, wow, he's in Click Clock Wood. Shulk9, thank you. Octo George, 1101, thank you. Beastman, 617, thank you so much. 
uh, <laughs> inspirational failures like Clark Raid? Question <laughs> mark. Awesome, Tarek Terry. Thank you, buddy. Donut. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, guys. You guys are awesome. Be sure to smash the like button while you're there as well. Help out that streamer. Jamie Kleinkoff, thank you so much for coming in on that Clark Raid as well. I appreciate it, guys. You guys supporting the YouTube gaming content creator community. Guys, thank you so much. It means a lot. We appreciate you. All right, so... Guys, thank you. Thank you so much. That's pretty much going to be the end of this live stream. I will be back with some more content uh, later this weekend. In fact, uh, you know, tomorrow, tomorrow night's going to be a special event. Uh, I'm going to be uh, joined by uh, two great Twitch streamers, Sideline Gamer and Classy Lad, as well as the Yellow Kazoo who raided us earlier. The four of us are going to be playing Super Mario Maker 2. We are going to be doing that uh, tomorrow night, somewhere around 9, 9.30 p.m. Eastern. Uh, you know, guys, just stay tuned for the details. We'll post the information on our Discord and on the channel as well. I hope you guys are excited and looking forward to that. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're basically going to be doing uh, Super Mario Maker 2 multiplayer races. Uh, I can't wait. And I hope you guys are excited for it. But anyway, guys, yeah, that's going to be it. That's going to be it for today's live stream of Banjo-Kazooie. For those of you that came by and joined us tonight, guys, thank you so much for the support and the interest. I really do appreciate it. Guys, if you enjoyed this live stream, be sure to smash that like button. Remember those likes and comments help the channel grow. More importantly, guys, if you're new to my channel and if you're enjoying the content I provide here, be sure to subscribe. And hit that notification bell next to it. That way you all can be notified when that next live stream is posted. You guys can follow me on social media. Links to Twitter, Discord, and Tumblr are in the description below. We're rating Papa Agron. Use hashtag Clark Raid in the chat. He's live streaming Banjo-Kazooie right now. Guys, we'll see you next time. Y'all have a great night. Take care.